Hey guys, so I'm going to the bank. So I'm just gonna take you guys with me. Um, and I'm gonna talk to you a little bit about this hair. And I'll record again in some light or whatever. Um but this is just a quick um rundown, like a drive through kind of like situation. But yeah, so I got this hair from Mrs. Lynn Hair Company and um it is awesome. So I got a 20 inch 360 lace frontal wig. Um, that means you can put it in a ponytail, you can put it all back, put it up half, to, up, half down, however you need to do that. Um, but it's really good hair, guys. So I just plucked it a little bit, not too much. Um, I plucked it a real little bit. Cause I was like tired or whatever. Um, and ready. You know how you just like done with hair. Yeah, I was already really excited when I first opened the box or whatever, and um, it was really soft. It had no smell to it. It was a bit dark to be um, a natural color. I, it came off to be kind of like 1B-ish, I think, in my own opinion, I don't know. Um, and the hair was not shedding or anything like that. Um, I did wash the hair and um, I put a, a deep conditioner in there. Um, I think it was like olive oil, citrus, orange conditioner. I forget the brand, I'm not sure, but I put that in there. Um, and I didn't leave it in there a long time. I just washed it normally like I would wash my normal hair. I have braids. I have small braids in my hair going straight back, like straight back cornrows. Which I probably shouldn't have did because I can kind of feel them a little bit. Um, because they're so small, but you know, and then, yeah, another thing. This wig is big head friendly. It has adjust adjustable straps in the back and a comb in the middle and two combs on the side. I did remove those and I went on to um, bleach the knots on my wig. Um, and it came out really good. I did dye like a piece right here. You can't see it because obviously we're in the shade. But in the picture, I think you can see it, the, the thumbnail, you can see it. Um, Yeah, um, yeah, like I said before, the hair is really soft, minimum shedding, and I believe I'm really getting shedding because I plucked it so much. You know, if you really don't know how to tweeze a frontal or a closure or something like that, I, I really wouldn't recommend it unless you know how to like use the powder and stuff like that because you know it, it, it did, um, you do have to pluck a bit much. Um, you know, because it doesn't come pre-plucked or anything like that. Um, but it is worth it. You know, I feel like you can watch it on YouTube, watch a video on YouTube or anything, or something like that. Sorry, and um, and pluck it like that. Learn how to pluck it like that. But yeah. Um, I'm actually really feeling it. Most people that I run into really like it. Um, and it is like, it's kind of like a, it's not like a yakky texture or anything. It's more like a relaxed texture. It has a relaxed texture to it. Fresh relaxer texture to it. Um, it's really soft, really smooth. Um, I don't know if it curls good or not because I, I didn't curl it and I'm not going to curl it because I don't plan on having it curled, but it does straighten out pretty good. It was bent this morning from me wearing my bonnet. I slept in this wig overnight because it is has glue on it or whatever, and I'm not about to take it off every day. I'm not. Um, and people who do that, salute you because I don't have time. I have a six, sorry, I have a three month old and a six year old to get ready in the mornings, and I just don't have 
the time of day to do that and she just bus just came out in front just do whatever they want but um I do want to order another wig I feel like I'm like talking all over the place but who cares I feel like I want another wig from Miss Lynn's hair company it is like really short maybe like to like right here and it's very curly um I really want that one and just wear like a short bob curly or whatever with the flip over method um I really, really, really want that one, and I know I'm gonna get it. But yeah, um, back to this wig here. Um, it does bleach pretty fast. Um, it does do that. Um, and once the, the knots are bleached, it looks so good. Like you have no idea. Um, I didn't put any foundation on there. I didn't put on a cap because, like I said, I was running out of town sorry I'm running out of time to um get the um the stocking caps I didn't have any time I didn't I ran out of time it was already late the pretty sure the hair store is closed so I already knew it wasn't gonna I wasn't gonna get it I'll probably get them for the next time when I wash it and then re-put it on I, my head is my head no don't get me wrong my head is big but my here to here is small so I did have to cut some um, other lace off that was like right here you know like on your ear tabs I did have to I did have to remove that because for one you don't want it to be like scratching on your ears or anything like that it, it can be very annoying and you don't you don't want it to be uncomfortable my wig is very comfortable it's not tight I don't feel it you know and I've never had a wig why I do not feel it on my head and because it's hot I did go in it um when I was styling the hair I took the curling one and I laid it flat and I just kept pressing it backwards like you know how some of you got you guys use the um hot comb I do not have a hot comb I need to get a hot comb but I do not have one I want one but I just don't have one so I just pressed it out like that I pressed it in the middle of my part I didn't pluck in my part usually I do pluck in my part but because I'm going to be changing this wig so frequently I don't want to pluck the part and have that that space there where you can see I did pluck my part I could just move it and you won't notice it um and this this like I said this if this was a I don't regret purchasing this hair it was um a very good purchase especially from these like aliexpress vendors they know how to get you so well with those pictures <laughs> they do they do they do know how to get you with the pictures but this one right here it's good like i'm so shocked at how good it came out you know um i'm so shocked but I'm excited about it and it makes me want to like get back into like doing these hair things I could possibly you know like change the hairstyle up and um, do something else just to see I don't know um, I don't know there's like and there's the part that really like I'm really excited about is the shedding yeah I have got no shedding if it was shedding it's because I, like I said I cut off the ear tabs and like the lace and that was coming out that's going to happen once you cut that's going to happen but once all that loose hair is out that's it you know there's not like loose hairs coming out of this hair like I'm not getting anything like I laid it with some mousse put my scarf on and that was it you know it wasn't nothing like oh if you don't know how to do hair you can't do this hairstyles unless it comes to like the plucking you know I could have easily put this hair back you know more like this and not have to pluck at all but because I want to push it back because it is a little hot out here I did um I pushed the hair back but um I'm really excited about my purchase um I watched a couple of views on YouTube about um you know the hair and how it was and 
how it took to color and stuff like that. And I was kind of like, I don't know, because, you know, them AliExpress vendors, they know how to get you. They do. Um, but I did. I got it. And I'm glad I got it. I really am. And I'm excited to get another one and, and review that one, too. Shoot. But you know, a lot of people don't don't review like do really good reviews on it on hair. And I'm not saying this is a good review. I'm just giving you guys, you know, my opinion on it because I just got it. And I've had this hair for about a week, and I just installed it last night. But I've but I have um. That car would not go. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm just driving. And people don't be paying attention. Jeez. They don't. They really don't. Um, but I'm really excited. You know, and I'm excited to be back and making videos. You know, I'll have more videos coming up about, you know, from my daughter and me doing her hair, her back to school hair. And I'll be doing more videos on, I guess, me doing my husband's hair and how I do that and braiding it and stuff like that I'll do that um, so I'm excited you know you know whether people watch or not who cares but I really am excited about sharing things with you guys and you know showing you guys a little piece of us and we will also have our family channel back up and running because I, I got a new phone, so the quality of the videos would be better. You know, it's hard to watch videos when the quality sucks. And then me and my sister will start probably something. Um, just to see, you know, you never know until you try, you know. Well, thank you guys for taking the time out to watch this video. Um, give it some thumbs up if I did good. Leave some comments down below on what I can do better or if you like the hair have any questions thank you guys bye bye